Hey guys, it's Jed. Uh, I'm going to show you in this video what I didn't show you in the last video or the last time I moved a swarm trap. So we're going to go ahead and take it down and notice it's dusk, okay? It ain't dark yet, so I'm going to wait just a couple minutes. As it gets darker, I'll go ahead and do it. But what you're going to do is actually get up in here into your swarm trap up here and then come up from above them where they can't see what you're doing. Cause they're gonna they're trying to figure out what you're doing but you don't want any of them to escape so just go ahead and seal them all the way around until the vent is over the hole that way they got they can breathe so here in a little while i'm gonna i'm gonna go ahead and take this down i'll unlatch it uh not here first but all what i'll do is i'll unscrew the two screws and then i'll take this bottom one uh loose and then uh, we'll keep this one connected because that's the that's the uh, you know swarm itself. And then we'll take it to its new location, and uh, we'll pick it up there. Okay, guys. I'll talk to you in a minute. Okay, it's sitting where I'm going to put it for right now. I just got it on wooden blocks, and uh, like I said, the vent is what's over the hole right now. Now what I got to do is I got to go ahead and cover up the uh, vent hole itself so that when they come in or try to get out they'll be covered by debris and they'll have they'll go and they'll reorient themselves to their new location because they'll think they've fallen out of a tree so i'll go ahead and cover it up and let you see that and then that'll pretty much be the end of the video uh from there onward uh i've got other videos that show show how you transfer them from the hive i'm sorry from the trap into their actual hive and do notice that i did put a level on the top to make sure that it is level side to side and pointing slightly to the front to bring the water to the front so uh, just so you understand what I did with the level there that way they build their comb straight okay so I'll come right back on as soon as I get uh, get it covered up all right guys talk to you talk to you in a minute okay so it's covered up and remember that I've got the entrance reduced the uh, entrance twirler there still set on that vent I have not placed it back to the opening which is up here at the top uh, right about there that's the opening right there in the plate see that there so I don't have it set on that okay so now it's night it's dark outside it's nighttime and uh, we'll leave it just like it is and then early in the morning now once they get completely calmed down then we'll come and go ahead and open up their their uh, their vent while it's daylight outside so when they come out uh, they're pretty much forced into an orientation flight as they eat their way through the debris. Okay, guys, so I hope that's helped you out. And again, uh, uh, you know, if you need to know what to do after you got a move, the swarm trap moved to its location and you want to switch them into a hive, uh, just go back and, and, and watch the videos. And I got a whole playlist uh, concerning what to do with your swarm once you uh, have caught a swarm. Okay, guys, so we're going to get on off here. We love you guys. Uh, get in the Word. Stay in the Word. Get the Word in you. It's the most important thing you could possibly do. Love and truth is the answer to all things, guys. I'll talk to you guys later.